So the assessments. Uh, what we are doing um, is that we are basically have the uh, uh, exam, which is 30% of the marks, and uh, we will be putting some example exam on Brightspace. I haven't done that yet. We've been too busy with helping people with the assignment. For those people who have extensions, we will help continue helping that, but hopefully we have a bit of time to actually put up some, some example uh, questions into Brightspace so that you can take some test exams uh, with the proviso that, well, for the test exam, we can let you know how, well, how many you got right. That is not necessarily the mark. We will uh, look at how things are how it's done to actually set a mark rather than just taking a flat percentage. Because we haven't done multiple choice for this unit at all yet. So that's what I'm going to do. How exactly will the exam work? Um, it is a multiple choice test. It will not immediately give you results. Be uh, the reason why it doesn't immediately give you the results is because I want to be able to actually um when i have the uh, to adjust the marks to make sure that it's either not really ridiculously low or ridiculously high uh, because we haven't done these tests before yet uh, that was always the intent anyway even for the on paper multiple choice tests i would look at the results and uh, not not necessarily graded on a curve, but look at it, what would the curve be, and make it something sensible, uh, just to make sure that the marks are uh, fair and representative. So how will it work? So there will be a time period uh, in which the test is live. Yeah, so I will look, uh, I will look at the, basically, Certain questions might be something that everyone gets wrong or everyone gets right, and I will adjust a little bit if necessary. But if I give you the mark immediately, I cannot do that. So that's how I do it. But let's say my hope is that I can just use the marks as is. But I don't, um, yeah, I'm not sure how it will work. Um, so it's online, it's just multiple choice. You will get a time period. Um, uh, we should do one and a half hour as originally planned. That should be more than plenty for 30 questions. Uh, and you will get, it's a bright space, multiple choice test. Um, I, we don't expect to be able to stop you to read the books or the slides. But remember, there's quite a lot of it. So if you do have to look everything up, you might be running out of time. There are also questions there that are not so. They are more about thinking about what does this mean, rather than that there is explicit explanation. And of course, video lectures. You cannot go and watch the video lecture for the right answer fast enough. It's just not going to work. The exam. When will it be? Um, the date I've been given provisionally is the twenty eighth of May. Uh, we'll try to also finalize it this week and make sure that I'm not overlapping with anyone else, etc. So the 28th of May is what uh, I've been told what it should be. Um, I've been suggested 10 a.m. I don't really care. 